Marauder. In the 15-ton weight range, the Marauder is a state-of-the-art mine-protected 4x4 armored vehicle. The Marauder, with excellent cross-country agility and speed, is rugged and robust. Designed to handle a payload of up to 4,500 kilograms, this vehicle offers excellent flexibility in the choice of weapons and equipment specific to the mission. The vehicle utilizes the well-proven militarized man power plant and driveline system integrated with a fully automatic four-speed transmission that offers excellent mobility on and off-road. The Marauder is independently proven to offer mine protection under any wheel of up to 8 kg TNT anywhere under the hull and 14 kg TNT for a blast. Extreme acceleration of a side blast or mine blast under the hull prevents injury from specially built anti-blast seats. The Marauder is rugged and robust, displaying excellent cross-country mobility and has been called the world's most unstoppable vehicle by Top Gear. The Marauder can cross all forms of terrain at incredible speeds thanks to its superior strategic mobility. It can be airlifted, C-130 and Chinook with little preparation. Number 3. Striker Striker is a family of eight-wheeled combat vehicles for the U.S. Army manufactured by General Dynamics Land Systems Canada and the Divisional General Dynamics Land Systems USA. Striker is based on the LAV-3 8x8 light armored vehicle from GDLS Canada, which has been in service since early 2001. The LAV-3 in itself the LAV-3 is itself a version of the Piranha 3 built by Moag of Switzerland, now part of GDLS Europe. The Striker is a 19-ton armored vehicle with full-time four-wheel drive and selectively eight-wheel drive. The vehicle can attain speeds of 62 miles per hour on metaled roads and has a maximum range of 312 miles. The basic infantry carrier vehicle provides armored protection for the two-man crew and a squad of nine infantry soldiers. Striker variants include the M1126 infantry carrier vehicle and the M1128 mobile gun system. Lenko Bearcat G2 The Lenko Bearcat G2 is used by several departments with the U.S. military for base perimeter patrol and convoy security missions. The Bearcat's floor plan is easily configurable, allowing for personalized seating and equipment storage. The G2's on-road tire package is capable of the high speeds and tight maneuvering experienced during convoy missions and urban security details. Base perimeter patrol and high-speed convoy protection are included in the Lenko Bearcat G2, which seats 10 to 12 fully fitted soldiers. Inca Sentry For persons that need serious protection, the Inca Sentry is a Ford F550 based SUV. The company is launching the Sentry Civilian for 2020 as the first edition of the machine open to the general public. Army units, SWAT, law enforcement agencies, and peacekeeping agencies may use the tactical attack and security vehicle. In harsh climatic conditions, it can execute missions. In 2014, Inca shifted armored vehicle production from the UAE to Canada in order to consolidate operations and improve the quality of products for both the military and civil markets. The Sentry APC has a wheelbase of 3.576 meters and a 4x4 drivetrain. It was developed and manufactured at the Inca's manufacturing facility in Toronto, Canada, starting in 2014. Occupants can enter and exit the vehicle through two doors located on each side and a rear door. The passenger compartment, engine bay, and important mechanical components are protected by perimeter armoring. Lynx Rheinmetall Land System, part of Rheinmetall's Vehicle Systems Division, developed the Lynx Armored Fighting Vehicle. On June 14, 2016, the Lynx, configured as a KF-31 infantry fighting vehicle, was unveiled to the public at the Eurosatory Defense Display. A state-of-the-art, highly protected, tracked armored vehicle produced by Rheinmetall is the Lynx Infantry Fighting Vehicle. Two options are possible for the Lynx IFV, the Lynx Kettenfahrzeug, KF-31, and the KF-41. The KF-31 is a weight of up to 38 tons and can accommodate three crew and six troops, while the KF-41 is an expanded version capable of carrying three crew and eight infantrymen. To enter and exit the vehicle, the commander, gunner, and driver are provided with hatch covers. The crew may also enter and leave the vehicle through the rear ramp that is hydraulically operated. 
At the rear of the crew compartment, the vehicle also has a roof hatch which serves as an observation point and an emergency exit. The Lynx IFV is mounted with a Rheinmetall Lance turret armed with a stabilized and externally powered 30mm or 35mm automatic cannon. The turret allows the crew to effectively engage targets at a maximum distance of 3,000 meters. Rheinmetall Boxer Under a binational program, the Boxer Armored Transport Vehicle is being developed. It is a state-of-the-art wheeled vehicle, highly mobile, whose modular design enables a wide range of mission-specific configurations. Consisting of a uniform drive module, user-specific mission modules of the Boxer Vehicle family can be quickly exchanged. For the first time, Rheinmetall presented the Boxer IFV variant at Euro Saturday 2014, which was equipped with the Rheinmetall Lance 30mm two-man turret. The IFV variant combines the Boxer's inherent high level of safety and unique versatility with the latest turret technology, offering state-of-the-art capabilities to meet increasing needs. Milcor 4x4 The Milcor 4x4 is a new armored personnel carrier built by Milcor, a South African defense vehicle manufacturer. The Milcor 4x4 APC is designed to meet the infantry carrier requirements of the African continent's armed forces and is used for troop transport, casualty evacuation, and riot control missions. The vehicle's top speed is 110 km per hour, and its maximum range is 1,000 km. Mine protection is provided by a V-shaped hull, and the Milcor 4x4 has a B7 level of ballistic protection. This level enables the crew to be protected from armor-piercing rifle rounds. On either side of the hull, there are stowage bins that act as blast panels that deflect an explosion from the shockwave. Extra safety features such as fire prevention system and a central tire inflation system are being considered by Milcor. The vehicle is equipped with a remote-controlled weapon station on the roof that is armed with a 12.7mm machine gun. An automatic grenade launcher can be mounted on the weapon station. MZKT-490-100 Volat designed and developed the MZKT-490-100 light armored vehicle to support the armed forces of the Republic of Belarus's missions. The MZKT-490-100 vehicle, which is 6.4 meters long and 3.3 meters wide, is mounted on a four-wheel chassis. It's made of steel and features a V-type hull configuration. It has a payload capacity of 1,500 kilograms and a total vehicle weight of 11,000 kilograms. It can carry up to eight troops and two crew members. The armored V-hull of the Volat MZKT-490-100 provides protection up to BR-4 of Belarusian standard GOSTR-5096-396, which is equivalent to Stanag-4569 Level 2. Yaroslavl motor plant built a 4.4-liter inline four-cylinder turbocharged TM's 53-452 diesel engine for the MZKT-490-100 light-armored vehicle. The engine produces 215 horsepower at 2600 RPMs, enabling the machine to achieve speeds of up to 120 km per hour. Gerlach 4x4 Zetor Engineering During the defense exhibition IDEB 2018 in Bratislava, Slovakia, Slovak company Zetor Engineering unveiled a prototype of its latest 4x4 armored vehicle named Gerlach. The vehicle was fully designed by the company based on the experiences of troops serving in modern combat operations in Iraq and Afghanistan who used similar wheeled armored vehicles. Armored Tactical Vehicle 4x4 4x4 Gerlach is a revolutionary model that reflects new fighting and safety factors arising from new current skills and experience from 21st century combat deployments. This vehicle is highly competitive due to its combination of safety, agility, and other advantages. To maximize the safety of the crew and the vehicle itself, Gerlach employs multi-stage construction elements. The vehicle is built on a unique chassis known as Rolling Chassis Zetor. Its gantry frame concept can withstand high dynamic effects, making it one of the key pillars of the vehicle's anti-mine defense. The Gerlach is powered by a six-cylinder MTU engine with 240 kilowatts, 326 horsepower, and 1300 newton meters of torque. 
which fits in perfectly with a 6-speed automatic gearbox to optimize output over the entire Revolution range.